Hey, what is up you guys? Today we are finally making the setup video. A lot of you have been requesting this, so today I'm finally going to show you where I sit at every day and stream on Twitch. I'm going to show you kind of my whole setup from my PC to my microphone to my lighting. I hope you enjoy. If you do, feel free to like the video, subscribe, and comment. I appreciate you here. Stay tuned for the video. Here is the full setup, guys. This is it. This is what I've got. Let's move on in and look at each component specifically. Right over here we have the regular decorations. You know, we also have some Dramax because wash your freaking hands. Coronavirus is real. Here we go. This is the first step in our process here. We do have a Mac still. I haven't gotten rid of it. People tell me that I probably should, but at this point, why the heck would I get rid of something that's worth a bunch of money? So we're keeping it. Um, I'll likely edit videos on there, but that's about all it'll accomplish for me. Beside that, we do have the tower. It's the Alienware Aurora R9. It has the Intel i7 processor and the 2060 Super NVIDIA. It does its purpose. It's amazing. It runs my games flawlessly. Next up, we have our dual monitor setup. Each of these monitors are both HP 1080p quality monitors with 144 Hz and one millisecond response time. They serve the purpose. They do, are um, NVIDIA G-Sync um, compatible, so I'm able to do that with my gaming on my left one specifically, as you see I have Valorant pulled up. This right here is what I see every day when I'm streaming. You can't really see it exactly, um, but there's you got the Twitch chat, you've got Streamlabs, and that's basically all I need to run my stream. Next up here, we do have a Blue Yeti microphone. Um, the next thing I'll be buying for that is a stand. A stand will be useful to make it where people can't hear every sound on my desk. That'll be the next purchase, which I'll make within probably a month and a half or two months. I do have Yamaha Studio Quality headphones. They are great for listening as well as streaming. People would probably prefer me using others, but they work for me now. Later on down the road, Next items I'll be buying are a brand new mouse and a brand new keyboard. These are pretty basic. People have been calling me out on it. But they work. They were cheap. And um, I'm going to say this again, but um, they work. <laughs> That's about all I can ask for at this moment. I do have a nice little circular light, ring light. It serves its purpose. It has three different colors of lighting. It does dim and it gets brighter. So that's kind of all I need it for. You can also put your phone in there and take selfies. Over here, kind of not really a part of the setup, not, not at this moment, but I do have a keyboard. I have a cord coming soon from Dell that'll make it where I can use this keyboard and hopefully play music through stream. Um, I would love to be able to create music for you guys and with you guys. Um, be looking forward to that. That should be coming soon, guys. Yep. That is kind of the basics of my setup here, guys. If there's anything else you want to know specifically, let me know. The PC specs will be in the comments or in the description. Yeah, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. It's going to be a bit shorter just because, you know, there's not that much to show. You know, um, another thing I would like to get in the future is a better chair. This one is mediocre from Staples. But, you know, it works. That's kind of where I'm at right now. If it works, I'm going to keep it. So I appreciate you guys for hanging out and looking at my setup. I appreciate you all for supporting me each and every day when I stream on twitch.tv forward slash the heat. I'll be live again tomorrow and the next day at 10 a.m. Hope to see you then. And that is Central Standard Time. Please drop a like, follow, and a comment on this video. I appreciate you all. Peace out, my friends.